A high-speed chase on US 211 ended tragically Friday morning when an armed suspect died from a self-inflicted gunshot wound after a standoff with law enforcement. The Page County Sheriff's Office says the incident unfolded over the course of an hour, involving multiple agencies. At around 9.12 a.m., Page County authorities received a teletype from the Rappahannock County Sheriff's Office. A teletype is a system used by law enforcement to share urgent information. The alert warned of a potentially suicidal man believed to be armed with a handgun and rifles heading toward Page County, just after 10 a.m. A Page County deputy spotted the suspect's vehicle near Bixler's Ferry Road and Airport Road. When the deputy attempted a traffic stop, the driver fled. During the pursuit, the suspect displayed a firearm, further escalating the situation. The pursuit came to a sudden halt at 10.27 a.m. When the vehicle stopped on US 211 between US 340 and Chrisman Hollow Road, deputies made several attempts to communicate with the driver, but received no response. A drone was deployed to survey the scene, and when officers approached, they discovered the man had died from an apparent self-inflicted gunshot wound. US 211 remained closed for about three hours as investigators processed the scene. The suspect's body has been sent to the office of the chief medical examiner for an autopsy and identification. Authorities have not released further details about the man at this time. In an unusual but compassionate move, the Page County Sheriff's Office offered condolences to the suspect's family, recognizing the tragedy of the situation despite the criminal circumstances. They also thanked local law enforcement partners for their assistance and urged anyone with information to contact the Page County Sheriff's Office Criminal Investigations Division. To stay updated on the latest local news, subscribe to Breaking Through News on the Newsbreak app or at breakingthrough.com.